now flying on to the United States of America for the much awaited Miss Universe pageant. Please give your warmest welcome to Miss Universe Philippines 2019, Cassini Jordi Gallegos. Once again, we'd like to request Mrs. Stella Marquez Araneca. We'd like to request for you to join our three queens again on stage to give them a very special message. Please get it. You're gonna get it for sure. And Emma, I can't 
wait for all your pasabogs and all those details that you're going to show in the gym. And you will win also with that winning smile. And for Kazini, I'm so excited for you also. I know that you've worked hard for this also. And that I remember before, we were like, you would be like seat mates in the bus also. And then you were so quiet. But now I've seen how you've, how you've grown so much. And I know that you're going to do your best. And I'm excited for the three of you. I don't want to be so emotional, but I'm so excited. And I know you will all do this for the Philippines. And we're all here for you. And also for Laren. Also Laren. <laughs> Laren, I'm so proud of you. I don't want to cry, but I can't express how, how proud I am. Um, if only I could fly to Montenegro <laughs> to like cheer you on and scream my lungs out holding the Philippine flag, I would. But I know that you know that I am there through spirit and I don't know. So for my KM beloved sisters, congratulations in advance. I know you worked hard for this and I'm so excited. We've been through a lot. Like for the past six to nine months, we've been together training all the time. Alam na lahat ng drama, lahat ng pinagdaanan, kung paano natin naabot kung saan tayo ngayon. And I know na hindi nyo kami bituguin at ibabalik nyo sa atin yung crowd na para sa atin. Thank you so much, Leren, for representing the Philippines with pride and honor. We are all proud of you, just like for my beloved sisters. And I know that you worked hard for that. Actually, para sa amin, ikaw pa rin Miss Globe 2019, right? But yeah, everything happens for a reason, and you don't need that crown because you are worthy of who you are. Thank you so much, and congratulations, everyone. PM ko na lang sa inyo yung iba. <laughs> Thank you! Okay, I guess I'll keep the mic now. It's my turn. Um, we will be here for another 30 minutes after my speech. Um, <laughs> I just want to take this moment to congratulate the two girls who are up here with me. Um, we truly have grown as sisters. Everyone usually thinks that pageants, you know, we're so competitive, but in fact, the only people who aren't competitive are the girls towards one another. We've grown so close together, and I love you girls. I know you'll do so, so well abroad, and I can't wait for, you know, the pasapo. Pasapo. Um, yeah, that's it. But thank you, thank you everyone for being here, and I love you.
for Miss Supernational, and you will bring back the crown again. Gazini, my roommate, for like two weeks. <laughs> Grave, you've grown so much, and I am so proud of who you've become. And the next time I will call you that Miss Universe Philippines anymore, you're the next Miss Universe.